Thank you for watching. If you're new, my name is Lynn. Thank you for stopping by. So today's video is going to be an exciting one. This will be one of my two New York hauls. So I decided to start with clothing since I recently uploaded a beauty haul not long ago. I've combined both clothing, accessories, and some like decor pieces as well. So I'm so excited for you guys to see this. I haven't unpacked anything yet since I wanted to save everything for you guys. So I have around 15 to 20 bags. 15 to 20 bags. So we better just jump right into it. If you enjoyed this haul, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and also be sure to hit that subscribe button. Leave your favorite item from the haul down below. I would love to know. And with that being said, let's just jump right into the first product. So the first store that I want to start off with is Alexander Wang. I'm not sure if you saw my New York vlog, but if you did, you've probably already seen this purse, you guys, but I have been wanting this purse for so, so long, probably for like the last two or three years. Do -do -do -do. So I picked up this purse from Alexander Wang with, which has the spikes down below and as you know I'm obsessed with spikes, that's my thing, so everything that has spikes in it, I need to get it. So I actually wanted to grab the black one but then I got to the store, I saw all these amazing designs and as you probably have seen I already have like every single bag that I have is black or white so when I saw this and I saw like the burgundy and the grey leather I immediately fell in love and I just needed to have this one instead so now I have something that can spice up all my black and white outfits and yeah I just love it so much so the bag was like $8.99 or $9.99 and it was on sale for five hundred and forty five or something so I thought that was a deal so these next item that I'm going to show you are from a few different stores actually so the piece that I picked up at Bloomingdale's which really really excites me a lot Ta -da -da! is this sweater right here you can probably see my excitement because I am loving this this is from Karl Lagerfeld and I paid $1.99 for this sweater totally worth it in my opinion because I love him so I really love that you can use this sweater for casual outfits but you can also spice up an outfit and make it more festive using the sweater because of the rainstorm it is really sparkling and I am obsessed with this sweater. So the next item I picked up is one of the items that I picked up before I left for a New York and it is a Armani jeans which I really love. I'm not sure if the camera picks it up but it has like that faux leather effect and I am loving it. Like it looks so good on. As you probably know by now my style kind of changed with the season so this really makes me feel like a rocker and totally like edgy which I am obsessed with for fall and winter so I really love how they cooperated the faux leather effect in this jean and I am just obsessed with it this is the lilac jean I will leave every item down below if I can find a link to them so be sure to check out the down bar or visit my blog where I will have a shop my haul so you will find everything on my blog which is linhovic.com so you can just go there I also have a lot of other fun posts you should definitely go and check it out so I got this jean as well then I got a sweater at H&M just a like regular sporty cropped sweater I love the hoodie as well which says power to the girls on it right here this is so sporty and also you can wear it like just to make your outfit look a lot more sporty I love it this was around nine bucks so of course I had to grab it if you saw my haul I did like back in the days I got this in olive as well you will find it at the divided collection then I got a similar sweater from second day which is also like a cropped top but this is knitted cotton I love it I paid around what is this in dollars? So I paid around $100 for this. I'm obsessed. So I can't wait to rock this sweater. Maybe with a faux leather and a faux leather hat or something. I think that will make the perfect outfit. So 
I got this sweater as well. So the next store that I went to is Senui 21. I unpacked these bags because if you saw my vlog, you know that I got like five bags from this store. So I really just took home one bag with me because I didn't want to bring everything in all the boxes and stuff because there was a lot of stuff, you guys. I bought something for my brother, my sister, and a lot of cute things. So I got three pair of shoes, which I'm very excited to show you guys. So I will start with the first pair, which did come in this box right here. Here. So the item that came in the red Valentino box is dee -dee -dee -dee, these rain boots right here. I mean, come on, have you seen anything more like special? So I have a pair from Ralph Lauren, but that's kind of the only one and they are very like up to my knees so I really wanted to get something that was a bit shorter. I love these. I love that they have like spikes on them and I just think these are so cute and red. So I paid $139.99 for these at sale and the value is $360. So I really saved a lot on these. So I'm very excited. I hope it will rain a lot for the next weeks or so because then I can rock my new rain boots. So the next pair of shoes I got are more boots, but these are from Gus and I just love them. I was actually going to buy a new pair of Uggs, but then I found these. I think these are so pretty because they are gold. So they come with faux fur inside them. They are so comfy. And these are also a little bit higher than the Uggs, which I really love. So I had to leave the box behind in the US because we couldn't bring a lot of boxes with us home. So I decided to go with the Valentino box because I wanted to have it displayed in my beauty room. But other than that, I had to leave it behind. So I'm not sure what the value of these were, but I paid $39.99 for these and I think that's a bargain. So I really love these as well. So the next thing I am very excited about as well, so I actually got four pair of shoes. I totally forgot that these were in my shoe shop already, but these are from Marc Jacobs. I love, love, love these boots, you guys. I saw them, I was like, I really need to get them. These were 180, I think, and the value are 539.99, which, it's an amazing deal so I really love these I think these are very different from all the other boots that I have so I really love that these goes a little bit higher and I'm obsessed with these so I can't wait to wear these I have been like dying to wear to try them out and unpack and film this video for you guys so I can finally start to wear all these things so the last pair of shoes that I got from Century 21 are these sneakers right here which is from US Polo I think these are so cute they are gray and pink which will be perfect for me because I am just obsessed and I paid $19 for these and they are valued for $40 so I saved 50% on these which are great in my opinion and I just I love them these are so lightweighted you guys so I can't wait to wear them and walk around in them so I am obsessed with Senua 21 you guys so if you ever are in New York I really recommend you to go and visit they always have like 65% off of stuff and you can get some great deals there it is right down with Grand Zero so you can also like combine a sightseeing thing with also a little bit of shopping so I really recommend it you can just take the subway right down to Christopher Street I think it is and then you walk right up and you see this store. so the next item that I picked up at Sandwich 21 is this Calvin Klein bralette so you guys probably know by now that I'm really into these ones I'm not like a huge bra person because they are very uncomfortable comfortable on me so I would love to walk around in these ones especially at home if I'm going to work out or anything like that and I paid $11.99 for these so these are so affordable at Century 21 and the value is 24 so I picked up this I also picked up some 
underwear as well because they had a deal on the Calvin Klein underwear. I think it was like three for 15 or something. Then last but not least from Century 21, I picked up two bags from Kenneth Cole, which I really think are very special, especially this one. I really love the black one because it has a lipstick on, a pair of sunglasses, a guitar, a note, a bird, a heart, and a star. This purse comes with two compartments as well, which I think is really great because you can fit different things in there. I paid... $19.99 in the value is $45. So I think this is a great purse as well. I can't wait to wear it. I really needed like a small black purse and I think it was so special with the detailing on. So I got that. And the other one that I picked up, I paid $19.99 for as well. And the value is also $45 on this one. So it also comes with two compartments over here, which is a little bit bigger than the other purse. And you can fit your camera in here, your wallet, your phone. And then you have this extra little room where you can keep change and coins and stuff like that, which I really think was perfect. So this is a brown faux leather. And I just love how it looks because I really needed some other purses than black ones so I picked up this as well and I am excited to wear these ones you guys so the next store that I went to down at Soho is Topshop you guys know that I love Topshop every time I'm traveling and I see a Topshop I have to go in because I am just obsessed with Topshop. So the first thing that I picked up is actually a dress and I am loving this dress, you guys. The fabric is great. It has a lot of stretch in it and it is also the kind of fabric which work as a hold-in which really will suck everything in and I love how this look as well it is just so gorgeous and this was on sale so the value is $210 and I paid $30 for this so I was like are you kidding me of course I need to get this dress I love the color I love the fabric I love everything about it so I got that so I also picked up two chokers from Topshop as well these were on sale this one was six dollars and this one was eleven dollar and I love that this one is like a silvery choker and this one is so special I think it's so cute with the pink flowers it has some stones on them and it also has this thing which really falls down which I really think will look very nice especially now that spring and summer is coming so I picked up these two chokers as well the next item that I picked up at Topshop is this gorgeous gorgeous silvery turtleneck sweater right here so as you probably have seen I already have two different kind of sweaters in this kind of fabric and material. I love the silvery sparkling thing and what really sold me with this one is the ruffles which goes around the shoulder. I think it is so cute and it is also down at the arms so I am obsessed with this sweater you guys and I paid $24 and the value and the original price was $52 so I really think that I made a steal a bargain so I'm glad we went to New York when there was like holiday sale and all that stuff because I got to pick up so many cute items for such a good price and last but not least from Topshop, I bought a pair of boots. These are ankle boots. And as you can see, it has a gorgeous sheen and glittery feel to them. I love how they have kind of just attached a lot of glitter to the shoes. And I think these are so incredible cute. I paid $30 for these and the original price was $60. So I saved 50%, which is always a great thing. So I am loving these as well. These are going straight to my glitter shelf here at my beauty room because you guys know that I just love everything that sparkles. So that was all the items that I picked up at Topshop. The next store that I'm going to to show you guys our Hollister. So you guys probably know by now that every time I'm traveling I always stop by Hollister to grab a sweatpants and stuff. I actually had two bags so I had to kind of push everything into one bag. 
So to start off, the first thing that I picked up at Hollister is this incredible, incredible soft sweat pen. So it has like a skinny effect because it comes with this ribbon right here, which will hold the pants onto your ankle, which is very good. And you also have the Hollister logo right here. And the fabric is just amazing, you guys. You should definitely come and feel this. And I also picked up a matching sweater to go with that and I love the detailing on the arm and they also come with a hoodie which is always great. So for the sweater I paid $34.95 and for the pants I paid $34.95 as well. So this was a great deal. I can't wait to try these on and rock them on a Sunday or when I'm editing. And then I also picked up a regular sweatshirt from Hollister. As you can see, it has the Hollister sign right on it. And then it's just total black and it also comes with a hoodie as well. So this sweater was $34.95 as well and then I also got a matching leggings to go with. I think the pink Hollister logo right here is so cute and then it has like the little bird on the back which I can't wait to wear. So this was $19.95 but they were also on 30% off which was a bargain so I got that as well. And the last thing that I picked up at Hollister is this huge huge scarf right here which is a pleated scarf in red and black. This was $24.95 and it was also 30% off and I just love this. This would go so well with my rain boots and that was all the products that I picked up from Hollister. So the next bag that I wanted to show you are not so clothing related but it is from Empire State Building, the souvenir shop and also a little something from Starbucks. So to start off with what I picked up when I was at the Empire State Building are these two incredible cute cups right here. These are coffee mugs or tea mugs. They were around $19.99 but if you bought two of them you got both for $30 which was a great deal and you guys know that I love coffee and I think this will be perfect now that I'm going back to school. And I think I will display one of these in my beauty room as well because I just love how cute they are and I just love everything about them. And the next thing that I picked up is also a coffee mug. This is from Starbucks. You probably saw it on my Snapchat. I think I was snapping this. And what I really love about this one is that it's kind of special. It's not like a regular Starbucks cup. This is in porcelain which kind of makes it very heavy and sturdy and it says Times Square New York City on it and it has like all these buildings and it says Broadway and theater and I just love it. So this was a perfect addition to my coffee mug collection as well. Then of course I had to stop by Victoria's Secret and get a few items as well from their store. So I picked up something from my sister as well which I already gave to her so I don't have it to show you but I picked up two of their fragrance body mist. So I am obsessed with the body mist from Victoria's Secret. So I got one which is called Vanilla Lace. It smells like delicious vanilla and you guys know that vanilla is my favorite scent. So of course I picked that up. And the other one that I picked up is called Pure Seduction. Mm, so this smells like heavenly strawberries and flowers and yeah, it just smells delicious. So these are definitely my two favorite scents which are out in the stores right now. I was smelling like a lot of body mist in the store and these were the only one which really caught my attention so I picked up those. So I also picked up some lingerie as well because they always have great deals and I love the quality and I'm not sure if I'm going to show everything. So one of the things that I picked up is this bralette or training bra which says rock the runway and then all the way around the band it says VSX, which I really love. I think this looks so sporty and so cute. And it actually reminds me a lot of swim swimwear, the quality on it. So this is from the Victoria Sport and I paid 
$15 for this, which were so inexpensive in my eyes because over here in Norway, these are actually very expensive. We don't have Victoria's Secret, but we have like Nike and stuff and they are very expensive. So for $15, oh my God, I just had to grab it. So I picked up five of these in all kinds of different colors. The reason why I'm showing you this is because of how the fabric is. I'm not sure if you're familiar with these, but Calvin Klein has some, which are my favorite, favorite, especially if you're wearing like tight clothing or a cute dress where you don't want your underwear to be seen. This actually works like skin and especially in this color if you have it on like it really really sticks to the skin and you won't see that you have underwear under. Definitely recommend to go and check out these kinds of underwear at Victoria's Secret. And that was some of the things that I got from Victoria's Secret. I also got some very sexy lingerie but I'm not going to show you that in this haul because I'm not sure how appropriate that is. So let's just jump over to the next bag which is Ta -da! Forever 21. As you guys know I'm obsessed. I love this store and this is a huge bag you guys. So the first thing that I always check out when I am at Forever 21 are sunglasses and of course I had to pick up a few pair. You know my obsession with sunglasses or I probably think you know already how obsessed I am. So I picked up four pair and I just love these. So this pair right here was nine dollar and just look how incredible cute they are, how cheap they are and I just love the mirror glasses in them and I probably look very stupid now with all these tags on but I love these. Then I also picked up another pair with mirror glasses which were seven dollar and ninety cents and you can probably see these like how incredible cool are these? I don't have anything in my collection so I really need to grab these and they were so inexpensive like I was oh my god are you kidding me when I was there? They had so many cute glasses for almost nothing so therefore I picked up four pairs. These you've probably already seen these were nine dollar as well. I wore them in my vlog and I just love how Big they are and how special they are with the gold hardware around the glass as well and I am obsessed with these. And the last pair that I picked up, I actually picked up the last day when we were there. These are also $7.90 and they, they also have like the mirror glasses as well but not that much and I really love this. I love the pink, I love the cat eye, I love everything about them. So these are of course going straight to my display where I display all my sunglasses because I am obsessed. So the next thing that I picked up at Forever 21 is probably one of the most exciting things that I picked up and that is this faux leather jacket right here which comes with faux fur as well around the neck and it has that biker effect. So I don't have anything like this in my collection when it comes to jackets so I really wanted to pick it up. I paid $39.90 for this. I got it in this size small. I just love how the details are. I just love the zippers. It comes with a silver hardware and you can also take off this faux fur if you want to as well. So I think this was a great jacket and for the price I mean oh, I just had to grab it and I am obsessed. So the next thing that I picked up at Forever 21 as well is this gorgeous blouse jacket right here. So it is a very like peachy pink color and I really love it. It reminds me a lot of all the earth colors which you can see out right now. It is a very light fabric and the jacket is very light as well and this I paid $19.94. This is called the Carrier Jacket. And I will, as I said, leave everything down below if I can find them. But I just love how this looks and I think this will look so cheek with the faux leather jeans from Armani and a white t-shirt or anything for summer and spring. So I can't wait to wear this as well. 
And so the next store is at the Grand Slam, which is a souvenir shop at Times Square. I love this store, you guys. They have like tree floors and a lot of great things to get for your family and friends or even yourself. They have everything. So the first thing that I picked up is these incredible cute golf balls, which says I love New York on them. I would probably not play with these. I will probably just keep them displayed in my golf cart. So these were perfect and I think they are just adorable and I just wanted to have them since I'm playing golf and I think this is a great memory to have with me. So I paid $12.99 for these. I picked up this beanie as well which has this fresh peachy color which says New York on it. It also comes with this little bomb bomb up here and also down here and I think these are so incredible cute you guys ah! but I am not like a huge fan of these kinds of beanies but still I got a memory from New York so I just had to have something when we walked back to the hotel because it was like minus five degrees and I was freezing and the wind was so cold so I picked up that as well so the next item that I picked up is this I Heart New York sweater. So if you saw my vlog, you know that I got PGs or PG pants. And I just wanted to have this with as well because I think it is so cute. But my PGs are in the washing room right now. So I just love everything like souvenirs. I always want to have memories. So this was $12.99, a bargain in my opinion. And I just love how cozy it is. So the last item that I'm going to show you are from Bat Body Work. I finally, finally got my hands on a candle. This is the Champagne toast candle it smells so delicious so fresh and i am just obsessed with it i also bought some other things at bath and body work and a lot of makeup from cvs walgreens sephora and all that stuff which will be in a own haul next week so be sure to keep your eyes open if you haven't subscribed hit that subscribe button right away and also be sure to hit that little bell down below so you can get notifications every time I upload. But this was the last thing that I wanted to show you in this haul. Also be sure to check out my other videos that I have going on here. Be sure to add me on Snapchat if you're interested in seeing what I'm doing when I'm not here on YouTube. And with that being said, if you haven't subscribed yet, be sure to subscribe. There will be a huge New York beauty haul up with products from CVS, Bath & Body Work, Sephora. I spent like $1,000 on Sephora. I know, I have a problem. There's a giveaway going up on Sunday and the beauty haul will go up on Wednesday. So I will see you then. Thank you so much for watching once again. I love you and I will see you on Sunday. Bye.